If you want to get your map out of QGIS, you can always do it from the map canvas via project, import, export, and then you can save it to an image or a PDF. But if you want to set up a more complex map layout, then you use print layout via project and new print layout. There's also a shortcut button in QGIS to the print layout, and I'll hit that now. I'll give it a name. Call it US lower 48 and this is just some population change data for the US lower 48 states between the 2010 and 2020 census. The states that declined in population are highlighted in red. When this happens, when you start a print layout, the first thing that's usually good to do is to maximize the window to give you as much space as possible. If you see the page zoomed out at all, then it's a good idea just to click on zoom full so you've got the whole page to work with. Now what I usually recommend before adding a map is right clicking the page and hitting page properties. So before you start deciding on what page size you'll use. By default, mine is on size A4, which is a common paper size here in the UK, but you can adjust that to any of the preset options or manually. So if I wanted a page that was 300 wide and 250 high, I can easily do that, but then I'll always click on the zoom full button. To add my map, I just need to click on the add map button and I'll just drag an area roughly where I want it to appear. And after that, I'll click on select move item and I'll position my map. Usually I put it so it's kind of neat and nice in the corners. And that's how you get your map into the print layout.